Hello, welcome to Tricky IELTS. I hope you are doing great. Those individuals who booked IELTS test in April 2020 should stay here. Watch this video till the end in order to get useful information relevant to upcoming IELTS exam. Keep in mind, the scheduled exam in April 2020 have been cancelled around the world due to coronavirus. So, don't be panic. What will you do now? I have a strategy for you. I'll share the strategy which will help you means uh, to get higher band whenever you will sit in the real exam in, in the end of May or in the beginning of June. Till that time, you have to practice at home. So, how you'll practice? I'm going to share a step by step. It's your duty to watch this video carefully. For listening, you have to means you have to give one hour to listening section uh, on daily basis. So, how you'll practice? You have to mean, uh, pick a test from Cambridge series means on daily basis you should do one listening test from Cambridge series. And for 30 minutes you should listen to various uh, documentaries like a British, American and Australian accent for 30 minutes. So means it will be more than enough if you just uh, do one listening test and if you just uh, means practice a uh, different uh, accent for 30 minutes. Practice more on multiple choice questions, map, table, completion and no more than one word. So these are the types of questions that uh, mean the chances of these questions are more whenever you will appear in the exam. So you may get these type of questions. So learn techniques that how to tackle these uh, types of questions in the real exam. So practice on these types of questions. For reading, you have to give 1 hour and 20 minutes on daily basis. You have to do one uh, reading test from Cambridge uh, series means on daily basis you should uh, pick one test and you should take a let. Try to complete the test within uh, 55 minutes and for 5 minutes uh, you have uh, means to review your answers. Learn techniques relevant to each type of reading questions. Means if you have techniques you will be able to find out your answers. Uh, easily and uh, it will help you to find maximum correct answers when you have techniques. Practice more on true false not given list of headings and multiple choice question as well as summary completion means target these types of question like true false not not given uh, list of headings multiple choice question and summary completion because these are the most frequently asked questions. So learn techniques and practice on these types of questions. For writing, you have to mean, uh, spend, you have to spend one hour and thirty minutes on a writing module. So how you'll practice, uh, it's your duty means to write one task one and one task two on daily basis. And then you have to evaluate it yourself. And you have to uh, mean work on your grammar for thirty minutes and learn various sentence structure. Means, uh, as I mentioned that you have to give one hour and uh, 30 minutes so for in 40 minutes you have to write task 1 and in, uh, in 20 minutes you have to write one task uh, mean in 40 minutes you have to write one task 2 and in uh, 20 minutes you have to write one task 1 and then you have to mean work on your grammar for 30 minutes means you should just improve your uh, sentence structure in order to secure higher band and what you'll have to do means if you just get uh, 5 or uh, 10 minutes extra so then you should learn at least 10 new words means uh, you have to learn 10 new words on daily basis if you do so uh, you, you will enhance your vocabulary which will help you in your speaking as well as in your writing module read a band 7 sample essay on daily basis means you should pick one uh, band 7 uh, sample essay and try to means uh, learn words and grammatical structures from that essay. Do not copy whatever they are uh, means writing. You should just uh, means learn vocabulary and uh, sentence structures like mean grammar range that how uh, do they use grammatical uh, structures. For speaking, you have to practice at least one hour. So uh, how you uh, practice, you have to record your voice then listen to uh, your voice and rectify your mistakes. Me, there are uh, means make limited topics for speaking. Uh, I have also um, uploaded a video relevant to uh, common speaking topics. You can uh, means watch that video and uh, I'll share the link here. And you have to practice on common topics. The common topics video I have mentioned earlier that I'll just share um, the link of that video. Means common topics like hometown, education, family, sports, technology, pollution, and tourism. Means you have to me target these uh, types of topics. Then you have to record your voice and listen to your uh, voice for mistakes. 
you have to stay in uh, in an english environment as much as you can as you know that now you'll have to stay at home so means you should just communicate uh, like uh, with your friends through whatsapp uh, uh, facebook messenger skype I mean you should use online resources to communicate and stay in english environment for as much as you can if you don't have that opportunity you should just uh, means watch various videos and uh, listen to various documentaries and uh, means record your voice again and again and uh, and sit in front of mirror and speak as much as you can so these were the possible areas which i have shared and i, I hope if you practice the way i i suggested you will surely uh, means get higher band wish you best uh, best of luck and stay safe thank you for watching